What's up, GG Nation? GG Legion. It's your fellow again. Strauss Man the GG. Another postcom video. And this here is the beta over the weekend Call of Duty World War II. As you can see here, I'm setting my character up, sorta. My, I know my face cam's kind of in the way, you can't really see what gun I'm using. But I'm using the STG, my favorite, favorite, favorite gun in this beta. I capped out with my cousin, uh, my cousin Jake, shout out to Jacob, fan of the channel. Uh, I capped out to level 20. Uh, I don't know if I do it here. I, I just uploaded a few games. I think I showed you all three maps on this as well. So we're gonna go through here. I think I just did team deathmatch, but I did play everything in the beta. Hard, you know, I not hardcore. Sorry, they didn't have hardcore. But this was my favorite map uh, by far in the beta. You get three maps. This was my favorite. Loved it because it was a snow level. Really, really cool. But I did everything. I did war. I did uh. Every single type of game mode on here, domination. We all played it. Advance and take position. This is just me playing by myself with others. This was a private Remember beta. Training. PS4 Make users only. Sorry to users of Xbox. And like that. The it will air. be a beta again this weekend, so everybody can play. It'll be open up to everybody. I believe. Uh, this was just the private one. I got to play it early on PS4. Got some footage for you. It's good stuff. And I think I started out pretty hot. Yeah, let's see. Let's check it out. There's some... I'm just going to tell you what I liked and what I didn't like about the beta, but let me see, uh... Let's see, uh, how... Let's see if I get it off to a good... Well, I think I do pretty good. There's one of these where I get off to a ridiculous start and it's epic. They kind of switched up a lot of things. They do have classes now. Uh, I like how they have, like, an intro video to each class and everything like that. Uh... For example, I believe I, I forgot what exactly this was called. Infantry, man. I think I was just the infantry. I, that was just the basic one, the basic one of war. And they, their special abilities where they would be able to stab, uh, stab. You. One of them, there's, I think they, the airborne. I think they can run. So they can have like so Each one had something unique. To it, there was one that actually built, uh, built, uh, oh, well, yeah, you see, I get my cock Molotov cocktails going on here. JJ's in my ear right here in the mic, but I, I'm still doing a post -com, I'm doing, I'm still, I'm doing a post -com video right now. <laughs> you were gone for a while, but what I liked about the, the World War II beta, for sure, it, you could tell that some people were still playing like Infinite Warfare and so forth that they were jumping every time they got shot and stuff, trying to use their exosuit. No exosuit in this, obviously it's World War II. Not gonna have an exosuit, anything like that. The ground game is real in this one, which I like a lot. It's, it's, it's very, very good. I, I'm actually pretty hyped. I'm hyped alone for Nazi Zombies. That's, you know, probably what I'm gonna buy it for. My cousin Jacob and I, we, we ran through war and killed it. I, I should have recorded some gameplay of that. Maybe I'll do that in the next video. Uh, in the next beta, because I think the beta's closed down. Like I said, this was over the weekend and everything. Oh man, I, I died right there. I got paid back. Everyone saw that. You didn't see it, JJ, but everybody saw it. <laughs> but it... It's... It's, uh... It's, it's good stuff. It's, it's good stuff. The beta... Felt really good. I mean, it was really quick. I mean, level 20, you cap out pretty instantly, pretty quick. I mean, Jacob, my cousin, did it on his first go. He probably played only like three hours and capped out. Uh, if you play War, you probably gain like three levels, which is really cool. It's very objective-based. It's their new game mode. Very objective-based. Like, for example, if you're on the offense, you have, to, you have to take down this house. Then you have to go build a bridge. And then you gotta get... Uh, and then you gotta disarm a bomb or not disarm but you gotta arm a bomb and then you got to you know guide the tank through and win it's really interesting obviously you're in defense you want to avoid that man i think i'm on the bad i think i won this one yeah victory but i think i was on a bad streak one of these games one of these uh, ma uh matches here you're gonna see them i ball out for a little while it's, it's just tough did you figure it out okay you did it because you were gone for because you were gone for a while. 
I have a reflex scope on this STG. Um, like I said, the the infantry, their special abilities, they get a bayonet at the end of their gun and they can stab people. Like instantly, it's like a one hit kill. Uh, one of the, the classes let you use shotgun, but all your shotgun shells were uh, set on fire, which was really cool. You know, they had incinerary shells, which is really, really cool. We won. I wasn't in the top three. I think I leveled up to 18 here. I basically used every single gun in the beta. My favorite, I just told you, was the STG. It felt like the closest, like, AK. But I had a special ability as Rifleman to have two primary weapons. So that's why you saw me running with a, sn a, sn a sniper rifle as well. Because that's why I used. I used both. Um, so this one's... Uh, this one's very much like what World War II was. A lot of trench warfare. You're gonna see. You're gonna see. It's kind of very dangerous to be in the trenches. Uh, trenches in this one. This map was really cool. Like I said, the the first map you saw was my favorite out of the three by far. They were all good. They were all cool. But my favorite was definitely that first one. And we'll see how it goes. You see everyone switching out, leaving the lobby, stuff like that. It was, it was really good. I liked. I liked the feeling of the guns. You know, to be honest with you. I really felt like they were copying Battlefield 1 when they announced this, World War 2, because Battlefield 1 did World War 1, and a lot of, you know, a lot of people kind of are tired of the exosuit, exosuit thing, the futuristic thing in COD. You know, I know a lot of people are. It's kind of crazy and hectic. They're always running and jumping. They kind of took that from Titanfall and so forth. Um, Team Deathmatch. But Time to show what you're made of, it, soldier. It wasn't. It felt really, really good. It felt very smooth. They definitely didn't take anything back. Battlefield definitely feels like Call of Duty. You know, I thought it would be sick of World War II to be honest with you, but it's actually really, really fun. It's really, really good. Mission begins now. Remember I'm training. liking it so far. Like what I played of the beta, so like I said, I got to level 20. It was, it was good stuff. It was, it was the hotness. Let's see if I can get on a roll here. Get on a roll here, cause I, I might trim this down a little bit, and it won't be so long. Or maybe I'll just post com on the. <laughs> I'll wait till the next part of the video, or I'll just end it here, possibly, because JJ did come back. He came back a lot sooner than I thought. I should have did this a lot sooner when I was doing a post-com video here. Uh, but I really appreciate everyone. We're probably gonna hit two. You, you're you're out, JJ. You gotta go to bed. Yeah. All right. Well, well, I'll, I'll keep going for a little bit then. I'll try to say my my only biggest criticism. There's still some. This is the, always the biggest criticism for me in Call of Duty, and they have it in every year's game. It's so annoying. And it's quick scoping, and they still have quick scoping in this game after years, like eight years of Call of Duty. Probably, probably ten years now at this point. Probably more. You know, of Call of Duty, they still have quick scoping. You still see you guys doing it. Um. It annoys me. That, that really bugs me, you know. <laughs> so I like to, I do like to snipe. But I don't. I like to do it the right way. Like in real life, snipers don't snipe that way. It bugs. It bugs me. It really does. Um, as you see, I kind of just kind of ran in a circle in that moment, and I kind of got, ended up getting killed. Each map kind of felt a little small. That's the humongous difference between Battlefield and Call of Duty. Obviously, the Battlefield maps are. Enormous, the big, and you really gotta play a team piece, uh, team based effort type gameplay. For this one, obviously, Call of Duty is a little bit smaller, maps are quicker. You can, it's kind of technically just like kind of like a big circle to be honest with you. But I, I really enjoyed the beta so far, and I think we lose. The, I don't. I think we make a comeback in this one. I know I started out very, very cool. As you can see, I just keep getting murdered. The light machine guns in this game. Are kind of I I didn't like I liked using them, but I never didn't really get a lot of kills. My my favorite stuff to use was this one, the STG, and the uh, there was a little Uzi that I liked a lot as well. There was a submachine gun. I don't remember exactly what it was called. I don't believe this is everything that's going to be in the game. What you play in the beta, of course, obviously. I don't think that's every single gun, every single unlock. I wanted to try out some other classes. I'll probably do that in the next beta this weekend. Because I think everybody gets it now. Like I said, I think it's an open beta. This was, again, a private beta for people that uh, play Call of Duty. 
I mean, not play Call of Duty. That pre-ordered it. They got and had a PS4. They got it early. The kill streaks were pretty cool. I like the Molotovs. Easy to get three kills. Boom! You get a Molotov cock. You get two Molotov cocktails. Go. I want to see. I want to show you guys on the next one because I, I, I kill it for a while there. Like I, I went on a nice little kill streak there. Yeah, this one I don't think I did so bad. I think I did okay. <laughs> I killed that dude, but he still got me with the Molotov and he saw right there. That was funny. Yeah, this is where we're making our. As you can see, I I very bad shot on that one. I horribly missed that dude. I should have lit that dude up. This gun was also really good for him firing. Jacob, Jacob also absolutely loved this gun. This gun was. I feel like this is gonna be one of the last guns you unlock. It feels so much like an AK. And that, that's always my favorite gun in Call of Duty. The gun that is very similar to the AK. Obviously now in most Call of Duties they don't really have AKs, they have a lot of futuristic type guns, beam weapons, stuff like that. I wish we got to play some zombies in this, obviously it's just the multiplayer beta. But Nazi zombies is the thing I'm most excited for, for sure. Otherwise, I, I'm trying to really figure out some other dislikes. I, I should have probably thought about that one, but I can't really... I just I just hate the quick scoping, man. I, if you don't like Call of Duty, you probably won't. Obviously, like this, probably. I think JJ would like this one a lot more than Infinite Warfare that we played a little bit last year. Oh no, was it Advanced Warfare? I think it was Advanced Warfare that JJ played. Is that the one you played, JJ? You guys can't hear me. My mic right now. I think my I think JJ would even like this one a lot because you don't have to worry about all that wall jumping and running. It's it's a ground based game for sure. Dude, this some dude just went off, man. That just put us humongously in the lead there. I should have probably switched up the guns in this gameplay, but I just I wanted to use my favorite gun. It's one of the last guns you unlock. Take that sucker. Oh, the Type 100. I like that one a lot, too. I just saw that. Oh, and the the P, the P fish. Uh, fish that's what my cousin called it. I like that one a lot. That was a really good submachine gun. Next time, I'll get Jacob on here and uh, we'll, we'll do uh, war again. I'll, I'll have some war gameplay because that was really, really good. That was really fun. We got a double kill, high caliber kill there. We oh, got 50 kills with the assault rifle there. <laughs> this is kind of where I kind of got my groove back, kind of like how Stella got her groove back. For sure. <laughs> Until I just got marked right there. <laughs> but it, it's good stuff, man. I, Tell me what you guys think of the beta below. In the trench. You know, like I said, this was the private one. Everyone that had a PS4. Not everyone, but everyone that pre-ordered and had a PS4 got to play it right away. They're opening it back up again this weekend for everyone, I believe. So Xbox, don't fret. Xbox One owners, you will get your COD. You'll get your COD on. Oh, did I miss that, dude? I totally missed that, dude. Victory. I think I won all three of these. I got one more game. Might not show you all of it. Show you a little bit of it. Might scrunch this one down a little. Might edit it. Oh, bro, I'm in the final kill cam, like, dude. They also changed. I forgot to change that. It's not like the final kill. The kill cam is not the the final kill anymore. It's it's just who had, had the best run. Like who killed like two or three people. They changed it. As you can see, where I died in there. So the only there was kind of moments I felt like the the especially in this particular area the the screen 
the login screen here. I really felt like it froze all the time, but then it just took forever to load a little bit. I don't know if that's a beta thing. Probably just a beta thing. Usually Call of Duty is a very smooth thing. They have a list of everything they, they fixed from the beta already, so I, I gotta read that. I should've probably read that. Should've read that before, you know, I uh, started post comment here. But they, they completely changed a lot of stuff already, I'm assuming. So it's gonna be interested to see what they changed, what they took out, what they improved. I'm assuming they did nerf some things, probably took down the STG's, you know, power a little bit. I feel like that, that was the gun most people were running with. I felt like if you were that particular class um, that had the incendiary shells, I believe they probably got to nerf that a little bit because it seemed pretty OP and you had pretty good, as I recall, shotguns didn't really have that much of range, I believe. Alright, so this is my favorite map again, so I'm probably just going to cut it here. I really appreciate you guys. Almost 2,000 views already. Going to hit my goal already. I'm going to try to get Dan the Man for a podcast this week. I think it's been a week and a half since I did one. And there's been a lot of gaming Eliminate news the enemy. And stuff going on. I know it's very, I know it's been very sports eccentric lately. I've been having a lot of, I got a, a lot of sports videos. I just did one earlier today about Matthew Stafford's contract extension and, and a little bit Hostiles of Kyrie Irving trade, which probably will go down. I think it will. And I thought I talked about the Floyd, uh, Floyd Mayweather and McGregor fight a little bit as well, and that did. I uh, JJ um, and Kleinbauer and I did Mud Squads. I'm gonna upload that video too. Super short video because I got disconnected. So you basically gonna make you basically gonna see me make one great play and then I'm gonna get disconnected. Um, but I really appreciate you guys. I it, it's we're doing so well for such a new channel and I just appreciate every single view. Grassman the GG. He's outie.